Monte Carlo simulation. Let's look at an example. Emma sells nasi lemak in packets. Every day, she makes 50 packets of nasi lemak. There are days when all of her packets of nasi lemak are sold. However, there are days when only 35, 40 or 45 packets of her nasi lemak are sold. Emma had recorded her sales for the past 60 days and she had obtained the following frequency distribution. Simulate Emma's sales for the next 10 days. To conduct a Monte Carlo simulation, firstly, set up a probability distribution for the variable of interest. To set up a probability distribution, divide each frequency with total frequency. Secondly, build a cumulative distribution. Thirdly, establish an interval of random numbers. The first interval of random number starts at 0, 1 and ends with the last two digits of cumulative probability. The next interval of random number starts at the next digits which is 16 and ends with the last two digits of cumulative probability. The last interval of random number ends at 0, 0. Next, generate random numbers. Random numbers need to be generated using computer. Suppose that the following random numbers have been generated for this example. Lastly, conduct the simulation. To conduct the simulation, build a simulation table. Begin the table with a column for day and write number 1 until 10 in the column. The second column is for random number. Write all random numbers that have been generated in the second column. The last column is for the variable of interest which is number of packets of nasi lemak sold. Now the first random number is 83. 83 lies in this interval. Thus, on day 1, 50 packets of nasi lemak will be sold. The second random number is 56. 56 lies in this interval. Thus, on day 2, 50 packets of nasi lemak will be sold. The third random number is 28. 28 lies in this interval. Thus, on day 3, 40 packets of nasi lemak will be sold. The fourth random number is 12. 12 lies in this interval. Thus, on day 4, 35 packets of nasi lemak will be sold. Continue the simulation until day 10.